everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. I am your host, the Drunk Panda, and Link, you need to stop being all sleepy. It's only 4 o'clock in the afternoon. Alright, so, first things first that we want to do with this episode. You remember those two eggs that we collected in the last episode? Well, we want to bring them in here. Ah, uh, this is going to be fun. Alrighty then. So, last episode we entered the pirate's fortress and we managed to steal back two e two Zora eggs, which cost about as much as a bug. In this episode, we're going to be collecting another bottle so that we can collect more more eggs and a couple pieces of heart. I bet you're wondering what we need to do for that though. Well, it's rather simple. All we have to do is face some beavers. Now, I know what you're thinking, not the, not the perverted kind, you little perverts. What we want to do is face the, the regular kind of beavers. And I'm a dolphin! Concussion! I'm a dolphin! Concussion! I'm a dolphin! Concussion! Ah, damn it. <laughs> I'm sorry, I couldn't resist. Uh, I, somebody reminded me of, uh, of the fact that uh, Chugga Conroy did something similar to my I'm a dolphin thing, and, uh, and uh, I couldn't resist. Oh, God! Leavers! Leave her me alone, leavers. Alright then, next thing we want to do is run over here and not get hit by leavers. Thank you very much. Just die already. Stupid piece of crap. Oh well, at least we're fully healed now. Alright then, now we want our hook shot. Because we're going to be turning back to normal. Don't you dare attack me, you piece of crap. Alrighty then, now what we want to do is aim for that little palm tree up there. And apparently we go clang here. Um, is there a lower one? Uh, where's another one that I can aim at? Uh, let's try getting on this log here. Maybe there's something we can do about it. Ah crap, the time's running out. Alright, aim a little higher. And voila! We're going to be climbing up these trees. The Navi has a little something for us there, but there's no point in going that way. No nothing, in nothing of importance that way either. That's a treasure chest filled with red rupee again. Uh, Alright then, this is probably a red rupee, so, but we're going to open it anyway. Yep, it's a red rupee. Alright then. So, now we climb up here. And, last but not least, up here. Crap, didn't mean to aim for that. Gotta lo I, gotta I love the hook shot as a kid, Link. It just, it's just freaking awesome. Alright, welcome to the Waterfall Rapids. And look, there's a beaver. Now, the premise of, the, of this game is that we're going to have to chase the beaver. Uh, that sounded very wrong. <laughs> All right then, let's let's target this beaver, and he will and he will float down, swim down to the bottom of the pool. We're going to have to join him down there. So let's go. And it's almost six o'clock. The first day is almost over. You again? You can't fool me with your green clothes. I'm guessing Mikau took care of this before. And holy crap, too much spinning here. You want an empty bottle, don't you? You never learn your lesson. Coo coo coo. Okay, I'll give you one. But only if you can swim through all the rings in the river in under two minutes. So, do you want to try? Sure. There's a total of 20 rings. You must swim through them in the right order for it to count. Swim through the ring that's flashing or spinning in place. I'll show you the way, so follow me and don't get separated. Shouldn't be too hard. Alright then. Now, the thing about this, uh, this race is that, uh,. <clears throat> Is that you have to follow this beaver? You cannot go faster than him at all. He will, he is again. He is like rubber band, ish. Uh, depending on how fast you go, he will go just slightly faster. Uh, but anyway, you you want to swim through the rings that he swims through, pretty much following him exactly. This is a cakewalk. It is so easy to do this one, and there is I've never had any issues with it before. Starting now. Ay ay ay! Come on, come on! 
That was random! <laughs> I've never done that before. <laughs> oh, get out of my way. Okay then, so we caught up to the beaver. And we're going to... Oh crap, we only have a minute left. Fortunately, they give you plenty of time to do this, so it's not much of an issue. Ah. I love how Mikao was swimming on upside down there. <laughs> uh, anyway, you should get there in plenty of time. If you don't, then you have serious issues with this game. <laughs> like me. <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> And here we are at the end already. That was easy. Uh, uh, that was perfect. That's not good. Did you call, little brother? I called you, big brother. Actually... What? An empty bottle. Yeah, an empty bottle. Don't worry, little brother. Two us empty bottles are a treasure. I can't give you one just because you beat my little bro. We can't just give you one. I'll give you one after you race once more against me. So, will you try? Yep. The rules are the same, but this time there are 25 rings. Don't fall behind. Alright, again, we have to do this again. Except this time there are 25 rings. Shouldn't be too hard. <clears throat> so, we just follow him once again. Now, this guy moves a lot faster than the last one. So, uh, so there's no way that you'll be able to get past him. It also makes it easier for you to fall behind him, but again, the path is pretty much the same with just a couple rings added. So there's not much much point in, uh, in doing this except for the bottle that, that they give you. Uh, and hopefully I don't bump on that tree again. <laughs> that was so random! I mean, seriously, I had never done that before. Alright, there's a flashing ring, or spinning ring, or whatever you want to call it. There's another one. Already we we have 12 left, so... Alright then. This Again, this isn't too hard. As long as you don't hit the outside of the ring, because you can't just swim through them like, like you could on maybe Diddy Kong Racing or Mario Kart or something. They made these rings actually solid, so if you bump into the edge, you have to start swimming again. Four rings left, and we only have 40 seconds. Oh boy. That means that we have that, that we must get one ring within every 10 seconds. Oh god, I got two. I must be going faster than the time limit. Oh god, that moon is scary. And with that... He did it, little... He did it, little brother. Yeah, he did it, big brother. There's nothing we can do, little brother. This is a mess, big brother. And with that, we get an empty bottle. This is our third one. We underestimated you. Seriously, they're like robots here. Alright, now. If you want to race again, which we want to do, they're right over here. He's back, little brother. Yeah, he's back, big brother. We don't have any more empty bottles, do we, little brother? No, we don't have any, big brother. If you say you still want to race, though, that's fine. What will you do? I'll race. First, you have to start with my little brother. This time, the time limit is 1 minute 50 seconds. Don't fall behind. And this is pretty much the exact same thing, except uh, shorter time limit. So I'll see you guys after I've done all the races. No, 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 no,
I just realized something. The beaver said that they've that they faced Mikau before. Does that mean that we're a better swimmer than Mikau is, even though technically we are Mikau right now? I So we're a better swimmer than we already are. What? He did it again, big brother. That shameful little brother. Now race me. What will you do? I'll race! The time limit is the same as it was for my little brother, 150, but there are 25 rings this time. Don't fall behind. Shouldn't be too hard. Oh my god, that moon is huge, I really don't want to be the daughter. He's a formidable opponent, little brother. You're all just talk, eh, big brother? If we give that to him, I wonder if he'll leave us alone, little brother. Yeah, I want to quit, big brother. And with that, you get a piece of heart. You've collected three pieces so far. Collect one more to extend your life energy. Please, let it be over. And they're done. That is all you can get from these guys. So, let's get out of here. Alright, next thing we want to do is... Jump. Hurt your animal! And with that, we are now underwater again. And that like light was holding a piece of heart! Let's collect it! You got a piece of heart! You've assembled a new heart container! Your maximum life energy has been increased! And that is just about what I wanted to do for today. In the next episode, we're going to be collecting a few more things. I think. No, wait, um... Actually, I want to do one last thing before, uh... Before uh, we do, before we get too far. Oh crap! Let me out! 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 Okay then, that was easy. Stay away from me! All right then, let's get over to the other side of the beach before those life likes get us. All right then. Let's keep moving, let's keep moving, let's keep moving, let's keep moving, let's keep moving. Oh crap. Leave us alone. Oh. 
Leave us alone, for Pete's sake! Alright then. So, remember that picture that I took before? Of the Gerudo Pirate? Well, this is where you want to put it. Well, this is where you want to take it. Hello? Oh my goodness. It's Shrek! Hooray, Shrek! I like seeing you, Shrek. <laughs> well, if it isn't a Zor if it isn't a Zora, how have been how have things been going lately? Ha <laughs> ha! Could you be coming to see me because you can't catch any fish? It's not good out there. Lately, I've been coming back empty-handed myself. Why? I was almost hoping you were coming to share with me. Alrighty then. So, apparently, he did manage to catch one fish, though. A seahorse! Help me! Please take me back to the waters near Pinnacle Rock! Are you interested in that fish? He's a rare fish, isn't it? It's called a seahorse! I call it swimming around here just off Pinnacle Rock. I call it Donkey. Since it's rare, I was thinking of selling it to the town carnival, which should be starting soon. If you want, I'll give it to you on one condition. Do you have a pictograph of, a, of the female pirates? And that is what he asks for in exchange. So, let's give him our picture. Oh, that's it, that's it! I had a picture like that! Well, aren't you, crafty one? You'll give it to me, won't you? In exchange, I'll give you this! And with that, you got a seahorse! Hurry, take it to its home at Pinnacle Rock. Well, we shall, but not until the next episode. Thank you, hurry, take me back to the waters near Pinnacle Rock! Alright then. Well, that's it for this episode, everybody. In the next episode, we're going to return that that seahorse where it belongs. To Pinnacle Rock. Oh god! Not again! Yeah, I'm gonna end the episode here. Bye-bye!